Eyewitness News this morning. Good morning, everybody. It is January 2nd, the first Monday of 2023. And you know, of course, it's a busy news day, but we want to begin with a look at our forecast, with, which means we begin with meteorologist Scott Haney. So first of all, Scott, Happy New Year. How are you, buddy? Haven't Happy seen you in a while. Happy New Year. How are you? How um, are your holidays? I'm doing fantastic. I'm wearing a tie that my daughter picked out as a Christmas gift. How nice is that? I'm the type of guy, if you give me a Christmas gift, I'm going to wear it within like two days. That's exactly. I'm the kind I of am. person that puts it in a box <laughs> and looks at it for six months and then says, oh, look, I have a gift. 431. Hi, everybody. Good morning. It is January 2nd. The holidays are in the rearview mirror. Next time I'm off is March 16th. So Who's get counting? used to me. Who's counting, though? <laughs> I'm not. All right, let's take a look. It is incredibly comfortable. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's much cooler than it was yesterday. But it's still incredibly comfortable out there in terms of our temperatures. Our Doppler scans stay dry. Remember, folks, the normal high for January 2nd is 36 degrees. It's 36 right now in Litchfield, 36 in stores, 37 in Meriden, 31 in Bristol. So a little bit cooler there in Bristol. And you might encounter just a little bit of frost out there this morning, but it's not widespread. Visibility, yeah, a little bit of fog rolling through parts of the state. Meriden down to four miles, but everybody else is doing between nine and 10. So we're doing pretty good. I drove through some of the worst fog of my life on New Year's Eve. It was horrendous. I stayed at my destination. New Year's Eve, I was like, I'm not getting back on the road. So I slept. Good, that's I, smart. Yeah, it was like, I'm not doing this. All right, so early morning future cast tomorrow's weather today shows us partly sunny skies during the day today. This is 6 p.m. tonight. We should be uh, under partly cloudy skies. And then tomorrow, we do run the risk for showers, particularly between the hours of about 11 o'clock a.m. and about 3 p.m. This is, it's raining in the state, and then that kind of winds down, and then we're expecting more showers through the day on Wednesday, on and off rain. There it is, Wednesday afternoon, so get out there and enjoy today. It looks like one of the better days of the upcoming seven. Partly sunny and mild today. Temperatures are going to be in the upper 40s, low 50s, which is substantially above average, and I'll have your full forecast coming up in less than 10. In the meantime,